Yo, how's it going guys? My name is Neon and I'm back with another Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War video. In today's Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War video, I've got a brand new unlimited XP glitch working after all the recent patches in the game. Now, I'm not going to make this video long, I'm not going to waste any time, I just want to talk about my giveaway real quick and that's it. Uh, so just go ahead and enter that if you want to win a boosting lobby on Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. Go to the description and you'll see all the steps there, it's from my sponsor Digizani, really nice people. Uh, they're hosting it, you get 5 boosting lobbies, um, it's really good, it's like 13 minutes a game, so if you want to enter that, go to the description. But anyway, uh, smack a like, subscribe to the channel, if we could hit 100 likes, it would honestly mean a ton to me since it's the Christmas season, and uh, smack a subscribe on the channel as well. Alright, let's get right into it, play the intro YouTube. Do you guys like in-game currency, game keys, boosting, gaming accessories and more? Then go ahead and check out digizani.com. Now they do a lot of things and I recommend you should go over to their website and at least check them out. They do Call of Duty recovery services on Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. They do boosting lobbies, call and card lobbies and stuff for Modern Warfare and a whole bunch of different Call of Duties. Now they have some discounts on right now and they've got some really good prices. Some things are actually getting sold out. If you go over there use code NEON at checkout because you'll also get uh, a discount so you'll get cheap prices plus a discount added on if you use code NEON at checkout and if you ever need any help with your purchase message me on Twitter if you've purchased anything and let me know and I'll help you out with it uh, but yeah just go ahead and do that now I'm going to get straight into this glitch so what you want to do is start up a game of zombies and you want to go ahead and build the ether scope okay so you and your friend or that you can do this solo as well it doesn't matter but I've got a friend help me with this big shout out to Dragon. Uh, you can check out his channel in the description if you want. But what you want to go ahead and do is build the E for scope by getting the parts, go to the anomaly, get the E for scope parts. Now, if you don't know how to go ahead and do that, just search up on YouTube how to build the Ether Scope. I'm sure you'll find a tutorial on it. Now, once you've done that, you go ahead and build the Ether Scope at the crafting table next to the pack a punch machine, and once you pick that up, you're ready to go ahead and do the next step of this god mode glitch. Now, this is brand new and it is super easy to be completely honest with you. So what you want to do next is go ahead and start the easter egg for the dancing zombies, so you, the one that you get the zombies to dance, and you do that by shooting all the orbs in the particle accelerator room. If you don't know how to do that, you can look it up on YouTube as well. But as soon as you shoot the last orb, put a timer on your phone for 60 seconds. So get a timer up ready to go, and as soon as you shoot the last orb, put the timer up for 60 seconds. Now it's going to teleport you into the anomaly as soon as you go ahead and shoot that last orb. And remember, activate that timer as soon as you shoot the orb. As soon as you shoot it, activate that timer. And what it's going to do is it's going to take you into the anomaly. And while that timer is still running and the zombies are dancing, all you want to do is go over to this side of the particle accelerator room and you'll see an anomaly rift um, that you can go ahead and use to spawn the characters in with the book. So you basically give them the book and it's going to go ahead and spawn a cutscene type of thing. So what you want to go ahead and do is just wait until the timer goes down to zero on your phone, okay? Now as soon as the timer does go down to zero, you just want to hold square to enter the anomaly and go ahead and give the reflection so you've got the book, you've done that. I don't really know what to call it because I don't know the actual complete words for it, but yeah, so you just want to wait the full minute. As you can see, I'm, I'm literally not cutting anything. As soon as you go ahead and wait the full minute and the minute's done, activate it and you will see this happening. Now as soon as it comes up on screen, um, as if you're going to leave the anomaly, you and your friend has to run away from that um, that area. So run away as soon as possible. Now my friend did not run away <laughs> in time and it teleported him under the map and he did end up dying. Uh, but when he spawned back in the next round he still had the god mode. But as you can see, once that is all complete you have got god mode. The zombies will ignore me, the zombies cannot kill me at all and I can just go ahead and get headshots, a bunch of XP, level up my guns and do anything I literally want. Um, also a lot of people will be wondering about the box you get after you do the easter egg, the dancing easter egg. Now you can pick that up and um, you can open that box but I wouldn't do it right now, I'd do it the round after because it does give you a chance of taking your god mode off you. But as you can see here, zombies will pile up in different locations, you can go ahead and just kill them and get a bunch of camos as I said. But as soon as the round is over, you can go ahead and pick up your box and get your free juggernaut and any gun you want. Now I recommend you do do this, there is a chance to take your god mode away but I recommend 
recommend you do do this because you can get a really good gun out of it. Um, as you'll be able to see on screen in a second, when I did it, I actually got the ray gun out of doing it. So as you can see, the round ended, I went down, I opened the box, and it gave me the ray gun, which is pretty pretty sick and it gave me free juggernaug which I gave my friend and uh, he spawned back in next round and now he has god mode as well. So yeah that's basically it for this video, if you enjoyed smack a like, subscribe to the channel and my name is Neon and I'm out, peace. <laughs>